How about this shot in Burlington this morning where it's chilly as we look towards the Adirondacks right now. It's Juniper Island out in the middle of the lake. 17 degrees right now with a light wind. We'll see those winds pick up a little bit later on as we head through this afternoon. How about this shot of Campbell's Hump this morning? What a beautiful sunrise we've got as we look from Plattsburgh back towards uh, the east and cold in Plattsburgh right now. 14 degrees with a calm wind as well. Temperatures, yes, single digits and teens. That is difficult stuff this morning for a lot of folks waking up and just getting outside here this morning. How about six in Saranac? I noticed Saranac Lake was below zero uh, in the last hour. A lot of single digits in the Adirondacks. Again, a little warmer in the Champlain Valley, but then up into the Northeast Kingdom looking at single digits again as well. Seven in Derby. How about some fours in Lindenville, Danville, and Cabot at this hour. A little warmer down to the south with temperatures into the 20s for some how about 26 degrees right now in Bennington, one of the warmer spots across that region. Over the next 12 hours, we'll see temperatures get up into the mid 30s for highs later on this afternoon. That sun uh, rise and uh, the sunshine this morning looking pretty good, but the clouds and the increase by lunchtime and some snow showers too as we head through later on this afternoon. Storm track for quiet this morning, already starting to see maybe a little bit of snow uh, just making its way towards the international border right now. There's more of it back towards the west. This little system going to bring in those snow showers as we get through later this afternoon. Here's future cast, not a big deal early on some sunshine to start, but notice by lunchtime those clouds in the increase and here comes some of the snow showers as well. We're not talking a lot here, but as it comes through this afternoon, I think maybe a couple of bursts of snow in spots and notice the timing here. This is right in the greater Burlington area at 430 this evening. So if you've got plants tonight and you're headed out, just be prepared. It could get slick. Uh, a little bit later on. We're not talking a lot about a lot of snow again, but uh, so many times we've seen it doesn't take a lot to cause some problems. So keep that in mind tonight. We quiet down overnight. We start with some sunshine tomorrow, mixing with afternoon clouds, and then that system moves in here for Monday, which brings us a pretty warm and windy and wet day. Periods of rain on Monday could see gusts up near 50 miles per hour. As the front moves through, it turns colder behind it, and we get in on snow showers to finish out Monday night and early Tuesday. How much snow are we talking about tonight? tonight. Not a lot. Again, a dusting to maybe an inch or two in some of the higher terrain. Breezy this afternoon as well. And then another round of some winds to deal with as we get into uh, early Monday and through the day on Monday. Some models calling for gusts up over 50 miles an hour. So this will be something to watch as we get into the start of next week. 33 today, 34 tomorrow. Rain and wind on Monday, about 54 for the high on Monday. Sun and clouds Tuesday, cooler before the next system moves in on Wednesday.